Yo, yo, what's up, gang? It's your boy Marquise, aka that's Delphine, son. All right, cool. So, what we got going on uh, in this video today, man? Is um, as y'all see, I changed the name on my channel. Delphine son, where that come from? As y'all can see, this is my mother right here. I actually got a uh, couple pieces made. We got this piece here made. Um, Delphine son, like you see, that's my mother. That's where it come from. I lost my mother a few years back. Uh, August. 2013, that's the day that I lost her, that day changed my life forever, never be the same, alright, uh, losing a parent, that's one of those things that, I mean, you can't describe it, man, you can't, you can't describe it whatsoever, like I said, it was a loss for me, uh, it still, still hurt to this day. Y'all hear noises in the background, you know, I'm driving. As y'all can see, I'm driving. But, um, it's a big loss. Big loss for me, man. Um, but, I, I use it as motivation in life, too. You get what I'm saying? Like I said, the channel name was Atlanta Banshee. I want it. <laughs> This channel to mean something to me. I got a lot of stuff that mean mean a lot to me, but this really means something to me. So that's why I kind of changed the name from Atlanta Banshee to Delphine Son. That's Delphine Son. Um, Atlanta Banshee was good. It was great. Uh, we ran it up with Atlanta Banshee, but I was gone make the change before you know I was kind of you know pushing it out I think I waited long enough so it was time to change the name on the channel that was something that we we, we had to do you know a lot of people ask me is this turning into like an automotive channel I don't Atlanta Banshee limited me on this channel. So that's another reason why I had to change the name too. Because a lot of people looking for, uh, you know, bikes. Bikes. We are going to be doing bikes on this channel, but, you know, I don't want to let that limit me because I'm going to be doing bikes, cars, travel, you know, all that good stuff. Um, to where I'm going to these different cities these different uh, these different cities these different states Twill was behind me that's why I was looking like that you know these different cities different states man so y'all can kind of see the behind the scenes and what 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 be going on man um, no matter if I'm going to Memphis Florida Louisiana back home um, no matter where I'm at, just to bring y'all in, get y'all insight, man. If y'all can't make it that year, however it go, y'all can tap in and see, man. So I'm trying to bring y'all all of that to the channel. Um, and what I mean back home is <coughs> I'm not originally from Atlanta. I've been in Atlanta for about eight years. Um, got lots of friends, family, <coughs> a lot of solid people here. So this is like my second home. But where I come from is a small town right outside of Chicago, Chicago, Illinois. It's called Joliet. And for those who are watching that actually know me, um, to be exact, it's from the hill. I come from First Projects on the hill um, that 
that's where I grew up at. <coughs> um, I grew up there in the projects. I was a baby kid. For sure was a baby kid. I was bad. Stayed on punishment. My mommy, she ain't play that type of stuff. You know what I mean? I, I remember when uh, I used to be on punishment. You know, the homies used to come by. They, they know if I'm on punishment or not. Either you're going to see me outside, or if you don't see me outside and you wonder where I'm at, only thing you got to do is look up in that window, that project window, you'll see me. Yeah, the OG, she wasn't having that at all, so uh, she was on my heels. But, you know, I was a knucklehead. Um, I was one of those kids to where if you say don't touch that stove, it's hot. I want to see how hot that stove was. I was one of those kids, so I got caught doing a lot of stuff, and a lot of stuff I did get caught with, you know what I mean? But make a long story short, you know, that's where the journey started. That's why I started riding bikes at. Uh, my uncle and my brother used to always buy me bikes. I had KXs. Uh, I done had all that stuff, man. Uh, I started at an early age, and they had big bikes too. So when I was young, I was riding these big bikes, this damn tow truck all on my damn hill. But I used to ride big bikes and stuff too when I was young. So um, yeah, that's where the back bike ride background come from. All my uncles, they used to ride bikes, so you know, it was in my blood for me to ride a bike, man. Um, I also had one of the YZF50s. I don't know if y'all remember them. That was the mini, the mini motorcycles. Yeah, my uncle had got me one of them. Couldn't tell me nothing. Thought I was popping back then with it, man. But, and I made those some, some pictures up so y'all can kind of check it out. I got some old pictures with me on old bikes. I think I put one up on a video. But, uh, throw some bike pictures up and some of my cars that I used to have too. So that's kind of why I'm doing cars. When I got about 18, that's when I, 17, 18, I was getting out on my own. So, you know, I was building cars back then too. Putting rims on them, all that good stuff. I think the last car I did, I did a, a 74 Buick Saber, kind of how the guy's doing it now. I actually redid that whole car. I didn't take it off the frame, but I redid the motor, I redid the interior, rims. Uh, I did everything to that car, man. And uh, car's always been a passion for me, too. So that's what, uh, you know, the car car background come from as well, man. So, just tapping in a little bit to let y'all know why I changed the name and give y'all a little bit, you know, about me. And don't, don't get it wrong. Um, don't think because you come from the projects, you know, everybody is bad. Everybody ain't bad. Everybody ain't gang members. It's actually some good good solid folk that come from them places. You know, it's, 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 it's bad people everywhere. Suburbs everywhere, you know what I mean? Just because it's the projects, I don't want y'all to think you know, it's bad. So you, you do got some good people to come from that, man. And I also want to thank all y'all too, man, like I said, for tuning in, watching these videos, commenting, giving feedback, like I said, positive or negative, I appreciate that, gang, I, I most definitely do, man, but I wish I could give y'all my whole life story, that's just a little bit of who I am, you know, just to bring y'all in a little closer, man, I know y'all see all these videos, and y'all like, who the hell is this dude, that's me, man. A lot of people see these YouTubers and uh, automatic 
basically, you know, they pass judgment on them. Can't judge people because you don't know what somebody has been through, man. But, uh, yeah, like I said, I owe the job this one. I had to. Uh, just to let y'all know why I changed that channel, man. Um, just said I appreciate y'all a lot because I, like I said, put blood, sweat, and tear, tears in this channel. Um, it costs to run this channel, so everything I'm doing, I'm actually paying for it to do it. It costs me, but it's free to y'all, but I ain't tripping long as whatever I'm doing, I can give y'all some free game. I mean, that, that, that matter the most to me, man. Um, just helping somebody out that may not want to go to the shop and may be inclined with their hands. They just, you know, need a little help. You know what I mean? So that's kind of what I what I kind of do it for. So uh, yeah, man, that's just a short preview of who I am. Y'all will see who I am uh, and these videos up and coming. Start being a little bit more open with y'all, uh, letting y'all see the inside and how things go. Pause. <laughs> Pause. See, so y'all can see how a lot of stuff go, man. But uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna get on this ride, this journey that I'm going on. Y'all know I'm in that.